Even sonar couldn't cover the entirety of it. Instead, Dr. Gorski calibrated the detector, so we had to look beneath the surface. And? What did you see then? Uh, more of the same. What protrudes above the ground is just the tip of the iceberg. We estimate it extends at least 50 meters underground. Uh, I see. Oh, uh, furthermore, it's not a single object. Down below, there is an entire root system. So vast that it's impossible to cover it at <coughs> once, either with a scanner or a detector. Have you followed its course? Dr. Gorski's doing just that. Gorski? Are you scanning those... roots? Affirmative. Uh, I'm headed westwards. Been going for a few hundred meters already. Still haven't reached the end of it. Sorry to interrupt, gentlemen, but I confirm my suspicions. This area has been tectonically inactive for a very long time. Tectonicamente inactive. The aeolian activity is minimal. Therefore, the material that has settled on, or rather covered this metallic structure, it's very old, which means these structures are even older. And what are we talking about here? <coughs> a few thousand years? Tens of thousands? Uh, I can't give a precise assessment, not yet. I'm asking for a rough estimate, Marit. Oh, uh, well then, I guess it... It could be hundreds of thousands, if not millions of years old. Mm. Anything else? Yes. These structures almost certainly didn't form through natural processes. Almost? Well, they don't look like anything I've seen before. And you know I've seen a lot, Lovick. Also, I can't find any scientific explanation for this form. Hmm. Could this be what the Alliance is here for? I oh, don't make me guess that. I really don't know. Uh, personally, I doubt it, Ask your data. The more research we do, the more convinced I am that it serves no purpose at all. It's even hard to imagine <coughs> this could ever have any function. Reed has come in. I've registered a slight change in the radiation readings. Hmm. And now? The level has significantly increased. No need to worry, Dr. Yasna. It's just x-rays from the active detector. Our probes are quite sensitive. They record even the slightest change. <coughs> Is one of our devices also causing an increase in the electromagnetic field? Electromagnetic? Isso, meu dois já. Cadê os dois? Estavam ali. Ixi, começou em ó. Ixi, olha lá. Fudeu, o bagulho tá louco. Carlton, você pode nos ouvir? Marit, we can't hear you. Damn it. What now, sir? We listen. Wait for the interference to pass. Uh, excuse me, but I don't think it will pass on its own. We need to take action. What do you suggest? We can land Dragonfly as close to their camp as possible. Doctor, you well know we can't. Stopped. Yeah, are you there? I am. Unfortunately alone. Working equipment gave me hope. But someone just abandoned it. Didn't even turn it off. That is indeed unfortunate. We need to expand our search radius.
We've gone over everything in that area. Pelo coval na escavação. Não tô achando nada aqui. Só uma mulher ali em cima. Tá, é pra cá então que eu tenho que ir. Cadê você? Com o Val. Pegando o Bilal. Coval, coval, vem aqui, coval. Someone's here. A coval também tá foi, foi pro pau, quer ver? Olha lá, coval. Mortal. Oh, não. Tá vivo? You're alive. Did you hear that, sir? Cobbles alive. I didn't doubt it for a second, doctor. What's his current state? Checking. Parameters normal, yet he's completely unresponsive. Jesus, so empty, just like Crowter's. Koval, what the hell is wrong with you? Are all the symptoms the same as Dr. Crowter's? <coughs> he's calm, calmer. Well, at least he's alive. Now listen to me, Yasna. The lander is on its way, but before you get Dr. Koval on board, I want you to do something. Yasna. Well I'm listening. Please look around for his journal. It's everywhere. 
in pieces. Ah, not good. Koval was in radio contact with <coughs> Dr. Gorski. Taking notes. That's exactly why it's so important. These notes may help us find our man. I'll go over them. But it may take a while. Huh. Have you found it? No, it's a... Uh... Nothing about Dr. Gorski. Você tem vida nesse planeta. Ramo de estrutura do subsolo. Verifica o ramo direito. Posição vertical massiva sobressai acima da superfície. Tanque de água estrutura subterrânea. O maior de todos. Dentro da corrida, 150 metros sinalizada. É visível. 1.4. Azimut. 350. Distância 200. Found them. Surprisingly accurate. He wrote down Gorski's every step. Great. Let's get Koval to the evacuation area. Can you carry him, Doctor? <laughs> Won't be pretty hard in 1G. But the gravity here should make things a tad easier. We got him. Carlos. Where are you there? Put Dr. Cobble in the seat. I'll connect the camera box through the Manda's antenna. Haven't you rebooted yet? No, not quite. But it will work now. The land is already descending. Damn. I have a bad feeling. It won't break into pieces, right? The descent is proceeding smoothly. Don't worry. Tem que levar o outro maluco lá também. Crowta. Na demo tem uns tipo uns nano robô que. Although the latter got Dr. Gorski's interest, for some reason. It's crazy how everything's falling apart here. I don't know. Maybe we're dealing with some kind of anomaly. An atmospheric or magnetic phenomenon. Yeah. Wouldn't something like that show on the charts? All those measurements Gorski took? I remember. Maybe he made a mistake. Maybe we ought to solve, huh? Gorski's left. He might have made it quite far. Agreed. Everything points to it. I don't know how long I'll be looking for him. It might take hours before I come back. It would be best if I followed Gorski right away. But shouldn't I still transfer the others? No, there's no need. I just regained control of the Androbot. So please, leave it to me. Understood. E o Gorsk está onde? Para a esquerda aqui? Ela está correndo agora. Excavation site. Huh. How did he come down? Pulou, ué. Aquele desse, ele pulou. Aí eu ouvi um barulho aquela hora, alguma coisa que parecia que tava aqui. Barulho, um batido. Um... 
Meio estranho. Tenho o signal de Gorsky. Tão rápido? É impossível que ele esteja aqui. Então quem? Não quem, mas o que? Você está correto, senhor. É apenas nossa probe. Ela parece inactiva. Não pode ser completamente broken se você pegou um signal. Eu diria que está correndo em safe mode. Por favor, tente parar isso. Temos tempo para isso? É por uma boa razão, doutor. A probe pode ser útil na busca. E, além disso, você vai ver. Você vai ver. Você vai ver. Ok. Estou abrindo a probe. Estou abrindo os sistemas. Não, não, não. Espera para as minhas instruções. Há um botão no lado esquerdo da caixa de fuso. Segura-o e depois turne o dial de novo. Slide records. Correct. I I didn't know we had access to them. You couldn't have known. This is not standard procedure. But as they say, extremis malis, extrema remedia. Let's take a look. Então as fotos. Esse peixe maluco. Mas pegar um peixe. A photo of the first days on the surface. They started exploring the littoral zone almost immediately. <coughs> Da chaga de escavação. I recognize these structures. This is where they began to dig. Twelve hours passed. Three crew members are still there. Doctor Gorski must have left already. We lost contact shortly thereafter. The probe followed him, and he followed the detector's <coughs> readings. Going after those metal structures. Yes, that's what I meant. What's next? Nada por enquanto. Last slide. There's mostly noise. Nothing in particular stands out to you, Doctor. They were digging and suddenly, poof! People are dead. No need to shout, Astrogator. I'm just letting you know what I see. That's all. Uh, hang on. An absurdly high electromagnetic field. <coughs> that's something. Sort of. What are the earlier readings? Checking. Still high in the slide just before. And earlier, quite normal. It happened in a matter of seconds. But there's... There's nothing except dunes. Sand, a few rocks, a shadow. Shadow? <coughs> Another sandstorm, I guess. All right, Doctor. Let's move on. You may turn on the fuses now. We'll take the probe with us. Fala, sonda. Is it working correctly? If you run it on manual steering, sir, then then it works just fine. Hmm. That's exactly what I'm doing. You have a keen eye. I'll put it in auto mode. From now on, it will follow you, Doctor. Oh, be nice to have some company. I mean, apart from yours, sir. One second. That's odd. There's no data in the probe's memory. No ID, no nothing. Do you want to give it a new ID? Name it, basically. After all, it'll be with you for a while. So, what's it going to be? Huh. A name for the telephone. <coughs> all right. I can think of something. Copy that. I'm listening. Bleep Bowie. Bowie. Please enter Bull E. B A L L dash E. Wowie, Bowie. Tweaks, and you'll have a flying measurement center at your disposal.
I don't see these metal structures anywhere. The only surface structure reported was from the excavation area. <coughs> the rest is underground. Please explore the area thoroughly. Just do as Dr. Gorski. Use the detector. The detector's measurement is very clear. I'm going straight on. No crossroads? Branches? Not yet. Just one thick, tangled vein. Que tem que achar? Departing. Yes, they're on their way. <laughs> so RT has transported Dr. Crowder. Affirmative. He's in the lander. However, the robot didn't find him in the tent. How's that? The doctor was already some distance from the camp. I think he was following you, Yasna. Sir, why didn't you say anything? <clears throat> the Androbot located him quickly enough. Estou seguindo aquilo ali, é isso? Oh, thank goodness, he's safe now. Tô confuso agora, hein? Tem que seguir essas estruturas aqui? Ah, tem lá embaixo, tem. O ramo de estrutura no subsolo, verifica o ramo direito. Se eu vertical massivo sobressai acima da superfície. Ixi, ramo direito, gente. Eu já errei então. Sobressai no subsolo, ele fica o ramo direito. Exposição vertical massiva sobressai acima da superfície. Tanque de água estrutura subterrânea. Olha
É, eu tô no ramo direito agora. Tem que dar uma esquerda. I'm still here, if you're wondering, sir. Water was mentioned in the notes. Around the third point. And I have a matching object here. All right. So how many are left? Two points. Or at least that's what he told Koval. What he did next? It's hard to assess. Well, the battery and the detector last for only a few hours. So he couldn't have gone much further. Mar todas dentro da colina, 150 metros sinalizado. Tô perdido, gente. Ponto quatro. O ponto é uma estrutura que se sente um rock massive. On top of which he found surface structures. Sounds like a crucial node in this whole system. Vou se aproximar para ver o que está escrito ali. Hum? Tá indo reto, acho que é reto, gente. Não sei. detected something. I see that in the readings. What is it exactly? From the structure from the notes, it fits the description perfectly. Well done, Bully. I knew I could count on you. Well, we didn't bring it to the surface for no reason. Even in the first stage procedure. And now I'm going to apply for my own. As soon as you find Dr. Gorski, I'll see to it myself. All right. How about that point? What does it look like? The next point, the third one, is a metal bundle running along the bottom of some water reservoir. Interesting. An object as such should be easy to locate. Tom, the lot they had. Water. Que é ali pra aquela subidinha mesmo, eu tava indo. O lugar que tem pra ir? Tem outro lugar pra ir? Acho que o terceiro ponto é ali. Status? What's 
you? Well, nothing, really. At least not in the last five seconds, sir. Huh? Right. Thank you. Pegar tão indo para lá. Né? Voltando de novo. I think we have the fourth point. Yes, yes. I just need a moment to think. Uh, as soon as you find something, I'll report it. No worries, sir. A maior de todas dentro da colina, 150 metros sinalizado. Cara, não achei isso aí, gente. 150 metros sinalizado. Ah, essa missão tracks on so much. Às vezes eu acho que você vai take off without me, sir. Não conta on it, doctor. Eu não vou em nenhum Uma volta parece. Né? Uh, my legs feel really heavy. Give yourself a moment to rest, Doctor. You certainly deserve it. Eu tenho que passar por baixo da colina, Bruno. Faço isso, eu não sei.
One step at a time, Yasna. One step at a time. Será que tem que dar a volta tipo entrar na colina? Time seems to be slipping through my fingers like sand. So much sand. You're so tired, Yasna. Because I am tired, Asugata. Ah, I've reached the top. The doctor discovered something new from here, something he called bushes. Huh. I've heard that term before. In their conversations? Between Kovel and Gorski? No, Jasna. You're the one who reported it to me. Right after you landed. Seriously? Well, I... I... I don't see anything like it now, sir. Wait. Kovel noted down the parameters. Azimus 350, a distance 200 meters. Copy that. I'm safe, <coughs> Grover. Got it. I see the bushes. And the doctor? Oh, hard to tell. Visibility is poor. Huh. It's going to be harder than before. I don't know how the doctor. But when it comes to finding a safe route, there won't be a problem. But you'll have to get there on your own two feet. I suppose a probe will carry out the first task. It's capable, yes? Of course. I said the environment analysis mode. The probe will calculate the best route between your location and your destination. It'll guide you along the defined path. The calculations will only take a moment. Bom. All right. Bully, lead the way. I must say, it's a clever device, this probe of ours. He could have fly for this long. Yes, longer than you can stand on your feet. Sounds like the perfect research unit. Maybe <coughs> even better than a human. Well, let's not exaggerate. I don't know. For me, it's only a matter of time before machines surpass their creators. The only question is when. Meio que eu já encontrar o caminho que. Oh, we have a problem. Something serious? Huh. Maybe it's true that machines will surpass us, but not today. The route determined by the algorithm goes over a chasm. I can repeat the command. No, no. I'll go around. Uh, unfortunately, this is an outdated model. Such mistakes are inevitable. But the perception module itself has already been greatly improved. Its accuracy increases exponentially. Exponentially? <laughs> can you imagine us? Procinaceous creatures developing so quickly, sir. No, not in the course of evolution. You can't perfect a person like that. That's right, you can't. Cadê, cadê você, Gorski? Gorski, cadê você? Have you started to fear for your position? Well, everything indicates. The clear distinction between humans and robots will soon disappear. 
We won't be limited by our own abilities. Robots will excel in areas where we either cannot or do not want to surpass them. To put it bluntly, they will do the dirty work for us. And we'll just sit in the warm privacy of a laboratory? Send them to the other side of the universe? Yeah. That's one example. É, o foda é a comunicação, né? Visão disso aí, né? Porque... Ah, mesmo assim, o tempo que eu conseguiria pra ver, isso aí demoraria, né? Não é um tempo, tipo, abril já. Porque se tá muito longe, o sinal não ia chegar tão rápido. Eu gostaria de uma descrição breve, que eu para usar para descrever a vida They grow out of cracks in the bare rock. <sighs> Astrogator, Gorski's not here. I'm afraid he continued to explore. And if he went where I think he did, he might have lost contact with the camp as well as Dragonfly. So we will most likely lose contact too. Possibly. Well, there's only one way to be certain. The line's breaking up, but I understood. I'll let you know, sir, when I come out of the tunnel. Qual vai ser a lembrança dela agora? Ah, tá descendo. Está em 12 mil, desacelere. Roger that. All systems work. All systems work. Descend. Hopper has landed. I repeat, Hopper has landed. Hopper is landing. Astrogator, can you hear me? Loud and clear. Any side effects? Landing wasn't too hard on you. All good. Spine still in one piece. No signs of overstrain. Not even shortness of breath. Perfect. Hopefully the hike to camp goes just as smoothly. Como é que ela perdeu, desmaiou e perdeu os negócios, perdeu essa baliza? I'm going outside. Visibility? 100%. The dust has already settled. Ah. I've located the second lander. Our people are still on this planet. Ah. I was afraid they might try to fly off, which wouldn't be the best idea given the loss of communication with Dragonfly. What about that lander, Yasna? You think our people tried to fly away on it? I seriously doubt it. Looks like a bad malfunction to me. But I'm taking Hopper out of here. You can't afford to lose this lander too. <sighs> We've gotten out of worse than this. Equipment breaks from time to time as <coughs> normal. Now, Caralho, go. Going, you? this lack Busy. of communication, it takes too long, especially considering there's a cyberneticist amongst them. Yes, it worries me too. Oh, damn, you were right, Cobble. It's beautiful here. Tem nada aqui. Site 1 é o acampamento? O que 
que é um. É, cabe pra lá, então tem que ter acabamento. Tô vendo barulho só. Ah, uh, enquanto traversando esse planeta, eu estou mais e mais convencido que o que eu sei não é o mesmo que o que existe. O que pode existir. Eu devo admitir que é um interessante pensamento. Mas é muito desesperado. Eu iria, eu, iria, eu iria armado, né? Vai descer num planeta que é o que isso aconteceu. A equipe tá sumindo. Sumiu, na verdade. Eu vou desarmado como se. Com essa moleza. Like some spiky metal growths. Artificial plants? Is spontaneous growth possible with this type of structure? Oh, I've never seen anything like. Oh, I feel nauseous. Suddenly. <laughs> That's not it. I feel darkness. <laughs> Ué, ela caiu aí, como é que ela acordou lá no outro lugar, hein? Ela caiu ali, como é que ela acordou lá no outro lugar, totalmente diferente? 